But girls, how you doing, boys and girls? <laughs> I have to articulate it, you know what I mean? I get too excited, that's what it is. Okay, <laughs> another pick account and today is gonna be you and them. So I like to do this regularly because it's quite interesting, I have to say, but it can be triggering, so stay cool. So two pounds and then we do a measure arcana, you know the deal, you know the deal. Okay, so let's go, seriously. One, two, one, two. So pound number one, you and them. Nine of cups, the world, two of sword, interesting. So, well, actually, it's quite fascinating here because someone was maybe in between two or very guarded at the level of the heart. It could have been yourself as well. It can be a bit both of you, you know, like, you know, mm, I don't know about you, you know, I'm just like, mm, very wary of you. So protection, protection, protection. Okay, so uh, the mind trying to protect the heart, yeah, it can work for a certain amount of time, but then, you know what, mm, the mind cannot justify everything eventually the heart is taking over because what we have here is a transformation we cannot be guarded forever eventually there is a new beginning a new chapter you traveling to each other you think very highly maybe of each other and you feel like yeah maybe i'm guarded but there is something here and i need to at least to meet up with that person to check it out I think it's important for you guys to meet face to face and I keep saying that to people, you know, technology, it's not the same. You cannot feel the body language or see the body language or feel the energy the same way. When you face to face, maybe go for a walk, something safe, you know, you don't have to go into a dinner because it turned out as a date there. Just have a conversation, a cup of tea, something nice and easy to, you know, talk to each other. Okay, so for me, it's a necessity to uh, exchange, to have a bit of a quality of time together, the proper this time. Okay, so there is a transformation here, inevitably, with the world, and you're entering a new chapter, and it's necessary, it's almost a natural progression of this connection. Because for me, to be guarded, as I say, you cannot be guarded forever. Eventually, things are going to transform, but it takes whatever it takes, right? Yeah, frustration for sure. And that's why you feel the need to meet up because maybe you both got it, but you both feel there is something. So why are we acting like this? What is it? Why are we so wary of each other? What is it? Let's talk about it. Let's be grown up and have a conversation. Maybe have closure as well, but at least let's not stay like this. You know, let's have a conversation and be out in the open, okay? What you have here is a potential all equality, um, I love you as much as you love me. This one is coming out a lot at the moment, which I'm very pleased because it's my favorite card. Uh, it's number six, pure love is longevity with a pentacle in that context. If it's about work, it's about being paid for what you're worth, be treated properly with respect. You know, there is a resolution here. It's necessary because you cannot stay in that vibe. This is, look at the colors, it's so, so different. This is really dark, this is very heavy, this is very unnatural. This is in the flow, very much. But you have to go through this. You have to have a conversation. So then you can reveal to each other how much you care for you, for each other. It's an idea of uh, come to peace with yourself. You're not happy. You know, you cannot uh, spend your life walking on eggshell because that's how you feel. Protection, protection, like living in fear. Oh my God, what's gonna happen next? What? No, life is to be enjoyed. You know, and, and it's really, it's about this. It's about that. You know what I mean? It's, you know, living in a real world, big time. So let's not be, you know, uh, hiding from each other, and particularly when it comes to feelings. Please, okay? Life is too short. I always say that. If you have an opportunity to be happy, happy, <laughs> grab it. Please, right? Okay, so let's have a major arcana, the chariot, yeah? It's rushing toward each other big time. It's traveling as well, very much. So the world is also very much traveling. Maybe someone has to come from a very uh, big distance, uh, maybe overseas and everything, to come and see you. But it's so worth it. Let's clear the air. Let's clear the air, please, right? And moving to the next level. Beautiful. So I love that one very much. Okay, so <laughs> what? So part number two, you and them, seriously. Wheel of Fortune, Nine of Wands, Seven of Cups. Mm. Nine of Wands is coming out a lot, as well as the Seven of Cups. Interesting. Um, yes, it's time to get to the next level. It's been a long journey, very annoying. A lot of fight, a lot of feisty energy here. What the point? 
it's exhausting. This is really exhausting. We need to get to the Ten of Wands and drop the attitude, drop that feisty energy because it's exhausting everybody. It's been a long journey, overthinking, uh, daydreaming, imagining what life could be together, but not living it. What the point? What the point? And then boom, transformation. Um, the Wheel of Fortune is also this idea of good luck on your side. Yes. Now we, we're going in the right direction, now we are in flow, we're going organically, we're following the real rhythm of life. If I carry on doing this, you're going to be seasick very soon. <laughs> Lovely. Okay, so, yeah, someone is moving towards you. It's an idea of a, of a you know, obviously a messenger, the knight, that's what they do. Uh, but it's very, uh, very powerful, full of uh, enthusiasm, passion, a bit all over the place, but at the same time, let's move forward because it's enough, you know, that darkness enough 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 boo my goodness 11 11 very interesting very powerful it could lead to marriage is an idea of uh, also being with um appreciated maybe in your work people really see that oh my god well done you congratulations oh my god you in a spotlight now big time is an idea of transformation here and an idea of um cons you know how can i say someone will celebrate you in one way or another because is overdue is a natural progression of either your position at work or your relationship this is a very uh, strong connection it is not i mean i don't want to name the twin flame thing because people put too much label on, on things and then they build up that story oh my god it's a twin flame oh my god no it's about learning to become truthful to be the true version of yourself it's not fluffiness here it's about tackling the deep issue here because you're gonna um in some ways you're gonna you know push the button of each other and inevitably you're gonna challenge each other and you're gonna have to work and that's why probably you're having some feisty conversation because you really press that button you just know and and you just you know you were trying <laughs> it's naturally you're in absolute pain really for each other <laughs> but a beautiful pain because if you tackle those issues then you become the best, best version of yourself and with each other. So it's absolutely stunning. But it's not a magnolia relationship. It's not, if it's about work, an easy process. But when you tackle your weaknesses, then you become so strong. It's, there is a price to pay, you know? There is a price tag here attached to this kind of relationship or achievement because it's to be triumphant at the end. But you pay the price. It doesn't happen overnight. Yeah, a lot of back and forth, back and forth. By the end of the day, you cannot leave each other because number eight, infinity number, right? Someone have to make a decision. You know, do I stay average or do I go for the real deal? But it's a bit of a gamble. It's dangerous. I'm going to have to really face myself here. Yeah, if you pretend to be when you're not and trying to put your head, you know, in, in, in a kind of hole and you can't even see the truth, you don't want to see the truth, you put everything under the carpet, that kind of a relationship, I ain't gonna work. That has to go big time. You can all say like that. And it's gonna be difficult and it's gonna be annoying, it's gonna be frustrating, it's gonna be sleepless night. But you know what? You can resist as much as you want. You can all stay in that mess. You're gonna have to open the heart. And that is very different from that, even in the colors, you know, you can just see. That is fake, that is truthful. This is uh, pretending and this is being vulnerable, but in the truth, beautiful. That's what I'm talking about, right? It's inevitable in my opinion, okay? So there's no, try, no need to try to avoid it. It's a natural growth, natural evolution. Okay, so let's have a major arcana, the hangman, yeah? You are, uh, you were, yeah, probably stuck in that vibe, and then boom, that's it. So it's a radical change, it's a radical transformation, as you say, because you cannot stay the same. The hangman was thinking, Oh, my life's gonna be that way, and that's gonna be fine, that's okay, I don't need to tackle the issues, and then, Oh, damn, right, I need to <laughs> now, definitely. Because you cannot carry on fluffing around, working on eggshell, pretending to be happy for the public when you're actually not. You have to be truthful. Damn right. Life is too short, man. I'm telling you. <laughs> on this note, have a beautiful day and I'll see you tomorrow. Mwah. Ciao.